Oh, look at it. 2004. I'm guessing that's when the game was released. I don't know what is next. But... Hello, my name is Ebony Thief, and I am playing Legends of Heroes Trails in the Sky. I got this. Normal. It's your funeral <laughs> nightmare? Oh god. I got this on Steam during the Steam sale, and I'm loving everything that I'm seeing. Aww. You don't look like you fit there. Neither does the food. The food doesn't belong there. Estelle? Daddy's really late. I even got a message from the guild saying he'd be home today, too. Ah, oh, jeez. Scara? And Scara's gone traveling around the kingdom in some kind of training. I'm so bored. Maybe I'll just practice with my staff a bit more before dinner. Man's voice. Hey, I'm home! Daddy! And he has a roast? Wow, your eyes are red, sir. Sorry I've kept you up. Sorry to have kept you waiting, Estelle. Did you take good care of the house while I was away? Of course I did. Did you run into any trouble, Daddy? You didn't get hurt fighting the bad monsters, did you? Nope, I'm fit as a fiddle. He's probably poisoned and he's gonna die. Or a monster's going to attack my house and uh, or he's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's going to die. A fishing pole? Sneakers? Something from my training? Maybe I raised you wrong. Aren't little girls supposed to like clothes and jewelry? I like pretty clothes. I like pretty clothes. But they just get dirty. And jewelry breaks when you go play outside with it on. I hate jewelry. I really do. I find that necklaces? They get caught on something? Along with bracelets and rings, everything just gets in my way, and I don't like any of it. Earrings are fine. Unless they're dangling and then they get in my way. Is that my present? Oh, you are a sharp one. Now why don't you have a- Now why don't you come have a look? A- uh, a person? What? What is this? Here's your present, I brought you a boy. Have fun, sweetie! What is this? Your name is Cassius? Is this a nightmare? This is not normal. This is not normal. Why is my present a boy? Don't make a fuss or you'll wake him. Wake him up? You mean he's still alive? I hope he wouldn't bring you a dead body. I've treated his wounds so he should be in stable condition. In the meantime, however... We'll need to let him rest. I need a timer. <laughs> you brought me a person as a gift. What is this, slavery? What the hell? What is this? What is this mess? I'm thinking right now. Wait, what? No, that's not correct. Okay. I'll put him to bed, so if you won't mind heating a kettle of water on the stove, I'd appreciate it. Okay. That is not... A present that is <laughs> he might be exhausted considering his wounds were treated I, I mean it's the first time I ever seen black hair like that so he is a refugee from a neighboring country that is at war right right it's a JRPG <laughs> that's usually how it goes he certainly does have a nice head of dark hair. And a pair of amber eyes to go with it. <laughs> it's like they're taking note of his value and his worth. <laughs> Jesus. That's nice and all, but how about you clean... How about you come clean and fess up? Fess up? Yeah, who is this kid anyway? And why is he hurt? Why did you bring him into our house? Is he an ill G May child or something? Did you betray mommy? 
Where have you been picking up on these kinds of words? Uh-huh. <laughs> yep, that's right. For heaven's sake. That girl is going to get me into trouble one of these days with all her nonsense. Actually, I just met this boy while I was out on business. I don't even know his name. You mean bracer business? Something like that. Oh, look. Huh? He's waking up. Is that his hand right there? I think so. He looks like he's in constant thought. Is that my tactician? Wow, his eyes really are the color of amber. Where am I? So you're awake now, are you? No. No, he's not. He's... just dead. Welcome to my humble home. This is not humble. I want this house. You'll be safe here, so please try to rest. What are you trying to pull, huh? You must be out of your mind. Why? Why didn't you just leave me there to die? Why? Now that's a question. I don't know how to answer. Does things just worked out that way work for you? Don't toy with me. Oh, he knows him. That's interesting. Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself involved in? Hey! Wow! Chick, calm down! You sure are shouting a lot for someone who's supposed to be hurt. Running your mouth like that is just gonna make it take longer for your body to heal. She just jumped on me. Aren't you gonna do anything about that? I'm Estelle. Estelle Bright. She's my daughter. Don't you remember me telling you that I had a daughter your age? Now that you mention it, so they were talking before he was hurt? Wait a minute, don't try to change the sub- oh, okay, wow, don't do that. <laughs> Both of you, just don't do that. But you jumping on me like that isn't going to make me heal any faster either. I don't hear you yelling again, do I? Look, a jumping on me like that is just gonna make things worse. Do I hear yelling? Never mind, just forget it. As a word of advice, it would be wise to not argue with Estelle while you're in this house. Even I wouldn't stand a chance if I made her mad enough. Yeah, I can see that. By the way, aren't you forgetting something? Your name! What do people call you? I told you mine already. It'll be impolite, um... Trying to hide it now will only serve as your deterrence. My name is... I get to input a name, right? Yes? Yes? I can keep it canon. I know nothing about this game. Oh, right. Ow. Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky. Trails. Okay. <laughs> Making sure it didn't say trials. Well, there's Estelle all grown. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Are you a dual wielder? Is that what you are? I like those. Just don't get hit. Have you aged at all?
That's the guild symbol, I'm pretty sure. Grace's guild. Was that mysterious guy? Pretty sure he's connected to that boy that's just boy and still doesn't have a name. So many characters. Ah, this is gonna be great! It's gonna be great. I'm ready. I'm ready. How is the battle system? Oh, <laughs> one egg? Oh, it's so bright in here. Hmm, ah! stop like a rock. Hmm, that must mean it's dad's turn to cook this morning. I wonder if it means Joshua. That's his name. I'm surprised I didn't get to give him a name. Oh, he's playing his harmonica. Well, I guess I better get myself ready then too. This is a nice piece of land. I have no idea who you are or where you came from. Are you some kind of prince? <laughs> nice, Joshua. Bravo. I mean, it's not the ocarina, but you know. Good morning, Estelle. He looks so happy now. Nah, I was already up when I heard you start to play. I can't believe how awake you are, even though the roosters still have bags under their eyes. Not that I mind. What with that siren song of yours gently lulling this beautiful woman from her slumber. What do you mean, woman? <laughs> so you're saying she's beautiful? Maybe the same age. Okay, they're the same age. Thank you. I think I understand that they're the same age. And that makes you something like my loyal follower, wouldn't you agree? Yeah, how fortunate for you. You could at least try and sound a tiny bit sincere. This game is having some trouble running. Might be normal, though. The whereabouts of light. Hmm. I wonder what that means. That's right. The whereabouts of light. He's gonna play that song in front of some kind of sealed temple. And it's gonna open. Yep. Compared to what it takes to use a staff, I think the harmonica is much easier. It's really, it's really just a matter of concentration. You're probably right. I guess my problem is just that if I don't do something that uses my whole body, I start to feel drowsy. Okay, playing the harmonica is fine and all, but how about getting some exercise too? All your hobbies are sitting around. Or sitting around kind of stuff and reading and music. No girl's gonna be impressed with just that. Well, excuse me for being so unpopular with the ladies. Although I feel I should be the one lecturing you about your hobbies. I mean, what kind of boy wants a girl who loves fishing, collecting bugs, ew, and has a fetish for sports shoes? That's enough talk about hobbies for now. And for your information, I graduated from the bug collecting a long time ago. 
really, I still believe that when I stop, when I stop finding beetles in the hallway, oh, yeah. Estelle, Joshua, breakfast is ready, get your butt down here. Oh, he calls him dad too, aww. Why don't the bookie hurry down before he gets cold? Okay, I'm on my way. Okay, I did not have to move. I still haven't moved my people yet. Thanks for the grub. Boy, am I stuffed. It was a single egg. <laughs> One egg. Are you eating or inhaling? <laughs> like people say, kids who eat and sleep a lot grow a lot. And they do. Don't know which way, though. Make sure you get enough to eat, but don't forget to pour that energy into your work, too. That reminds me. Vampire. You two are finishing up your training at the guild today, aren't you? That's right, it'll be a review of everything we've learned up to this point. Which is nothing, I don't know what you're talking about. That means I'm not going to let you treat me like a kid anymore, either. You still lack understanding, Estelle. You can only become a junior bracer in the beginning. Or in other words, a trainee. If you want to be treated like an adult, then you should work extra hard in your training to become a full-fledged bracer. Well, I'm not afraid of a little hard work. Just you watch and see what I'm capable of, Dad. I'll be so successful, it won't be long before I pass you two. That's the spirit. He's gonna wind up dead when we come back. Let's not start a rivalry here, you two. And to still, keep your focus on the task at hand. We have a test later on today, remember? Huh? Wait, what test? <laughs> His look. Please tell me that you didn't forget about the test, Estelle. You know, the one that checks whether or not we've mastered the skill we've been learning and training. Don't you remember Scara saying that if we failed, we'd be stuck with a ton of extra homework? Crap, totally forgot. Now that you mention it, I guess I kind of remember her saying something like that. Don't sweat it, I'm sure we'll manage somehow or another. I honestly don't know how you survived this long, Estelle. Your brain is like a, a sieve, sieve? What? Papa is sad. <laughs> how could any child of mine end up with such a careless, over-optimistic over personality? Ha, you're the one that raised me, so I definitely got it from you. I swear the two of you act so much alike, but whatever. We should probably head to the guild soon, Estelle. Scare's gonna be waiting for us. Sounds like a plan, you know her, but okay. Can I move? Can I move? Are those bottles of wine just sitting on the floor? Before I forget, it's my turn to cook dinner tonight. Is there anything in particular you'd like to eat, Dad? Any requests? That's my first side quest. What? <laughs> I know, right? What is that? I think that's a little more than Estelle's cooking skills can handle. And our stomachs. Oh, you're right. I'll have the usual... Okay, thank you. Thank you, phone. I'll have the usual fried fish and omelets. No need for anything fancy. But do try to make anything edible. He is definitely going to be dead. Ooh, what's going to be in the paper? One copy of the liberal news and fried fish and omelette. Do we have everything? Oh, wow. Money. I don't spend money in RPGs ever. Okay, we're heading out. Later, Dad. Yes! I can run around! Yeah! Oh, I did not want to leave. Yeah! They move so fast. Wow. I think she's definitely burning off that breakfast just by running around everywhere. Ooh, ooh, can I? Oh! Ooh, the map. Huh. Can 
I look at anything? What about this? This was the balcony. Okay, so that's the balcony. This is bedroom. I can't. So that's how interacting works. Exclamation point. That means I can interact with it. Okay, I'll leave. Alright, I'm gonna cut it here. And run around in circles! Alright, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode.